steel. So this tells you the kind of steel and if you go look in look in Shigli in the last few pages you will find hot rolled, cold rolled, all kinds of stuff. So you can go normalized, annealed. So let us go back up here. 1050 hot rolled. Can you see that? Oops. So let's go up here. I cut and paste from Shigli. So if you go look here, let us see. Hey, sorry about that. I keep bouncing around uh, because I'm still not completely used to that. So I want you to understand that what we are really interested in. Why the heck? What we are really interested in. Oh, I know what it is. I bring my pen too close. What we are really interested in is in the tensile strength. Okay, and the first unit is megapascals, the second unit is K kpsi, so this is roughly along the column G. So I go 1040, 1050, sorry, we go up here, there, 1030, 10, 1050 hot roll, that's 620 megapascals. I'm sorry, I keep bouncing around, I'm still not used to it completely. Hot roll, 1050 is 620 megapascals, it's here. Hot roll 1050, 620 megapascals is UT, SUT. Okay, um, that's our number, and uh, we can now estimate everything from this. That's all I need. If I know the ultimate tensile strength, I can estimate everything. So let us go up and see how to do that. Oops. So let's close this. We go up here and we go here. So we need to know only one thing. <coughs> 630 MPA. So, which is divided by 7, uh, 9 7s so are 63, so it's about 9 TKSI. So, I can go up here and I can look up everything. So, first thing to do is to say SE prime equals um, 0 0.5 times 630 which is 315 MPa. That means if the stress is below 315 MPa, this is the infinite life. How about the 10 to the 3 life? F equals from here, from this graph. 90 PSI, S, F is about 0.86. Can you see that? about 0.86 right there. There you go. So F equal to 0 0.86. Um, so now we are all set. We can calculate B. B is minus one third log SF prime over SE prime. So, which is equal to minus one third log 0.86 SUT divided by 0 0.5 SUT, which turns out to be minus 0 0.0785. So, now we got every piece of information. So, now we get SF prime.
So let us see. S n prime equals zero point eight six over S u t n over ten to the three times minus zero point zero seven eight five. If you do this, you can find for any value of n. So you can find, uh, you know, you can find the fatigue strength for any value of n. In class, we will do several homework problems on this. So be prepared to come to class and uh, solve some problems which involve finding the uh, fatigue life for any particular load. Thank you.